Hi guys, how are you today? I will explain to you how we can uh, hook the site bad website builder to the WXMS into a specific product ID. It's not for it's not for all a product, but a specific product. So the first thing we need to go to the website sitebad.com, then go to the document here, look to the WHCMS sitebad hook. Then you can download the WHMS sitebad.zip, upload it to the path to the WHMS and include hooks. I'm already download one. We will find and include this file, sitebad and sitebad dash playback, sitebad, etc. So I will upload like all of them to the my website directory. So I will go to the cPanel, from the cPanel I go to the any code file here, then go to the hooks, I'm already uploaded here before, so all that you need to do upload this file into this uh, directory or into this uh, path. Now I will edit the sitebad.php, uh, click on it, edit then we look to the label and name just go scroll down to the end we'll find the name here it was like site but uh, website builder and site but website builder then i will give you the custom link i did before that's a perfect link it's better from the original one so you can find this link on description and just copy paste it on this location the another edit we can do into the sitebad etc to target a specific order so look like here i target the uh, sitebad to the product uh, array 33 34 35 so what's mean the 33 34 35 the product number I just created uh, on WHMS. If I go to my WCMS, my product, so here I will look to product ID. When I put the uh, edit icon, I will see by end of the page uh, edit and ID equal 33, here 34 and 35. So this product ID. Uh, for the actual product so I just take it put it to the array I do not need uh, to show the website builder for all a product I need it to the specific product that's mean just for the website builder plan when I put this here save it and go to the editor edit I just tell you before I will uh, give you this link on description you can find it on description because the original one I will show you the original link is not work for WSMS I will show you then I will explain to you why so here we need just a code here we'll go by end of the page what is the link here the link this one it's called a client area.php a question mark action the product data equal id and get the id here put it here and login like go to the login and md5 that's that's mean to the database we do not need this one because already we log in i will show you the example if i go to my account here i i will see the website builder here and ink post website builder so when i click here just go to the create a new website but i will show you something if i go to the change to original code it will uh, it will be uh, hidden so 
I just go to the original file here. I will take the whole sentence, this one, like this one, yes, this one, enter here, copy, and go here. I'll show you something that's the original code website so here it will be hidden why hidden because I lose the target for the product ID so just take my code from description put it like this one and enjoy it. then in the second video or next video I will show you how we can create this section like a book link but especially for the product ID because the CBNL interface is shown on the on the all product so I will show you how like targeting like special the specific or special uh, product and show this section like this one so now I just refresh it. I will get it look like this. Click on it. I'm creating new website, like static page as a website builder. So click here. I will show you how we can do the custom CSS or style for this page uh, and change it from the server because all the CSS here is located on the server. It's not like physical file or like actual file so now uh, I cover everything about the hook so if you need anything just let me know uh, put it in, in the description I will follow you if you need help